What's up guys, this is Will of Will H Tech Review back with another video and today I'm going to talk about one of my favorite apps that I like to use when I'm using my two Samsung devices together and the name of the app is Samsung Flow. Uh, what Samsung Flow is, it allows you to connect your two devices, your two Samsung devices or your PC to your device and it allows you to send pictures, videos, Mary is strain. Uh, you can text message. And I think with some phones, you may be able to answer calls and things of that nature as well. I'm using the Samsung Galaxy Note 9, which this will be being replaced here soon, guys. I haven't bought a phone in a while, but this one will be leaving. I really enjoy the app, mainly when I'm in a place where there's no Wi-Fi. Then I uh, connect uh, to Samsung Flow. You can pick Flow up in the App Store. This has been out a long time. And I just decided to make this video to let you guys know what I like to use. So uh, let's give you a little information about the Samsung Flow. Uh, right here it says Samsung Flow is a software product that enables seamless, secure, connected ex experience across your devices. You can use this with your PCs. Uh, your tablets, you can use this as a mobile hotspot, things of that nature, but you can go over to the app store and check it out. And uh, so let me tell you what I like to do here. So I like to use the screen mirroring mode when I'm wet, not in a Wi-Fi area. And I just love doing this to watch my videos and things. So I think I'm already connected here through uh, through, the, through the app. So in order to mirror your screen, you have to go over here in this corner. And right here, this is called Smart View. So in a minute here, now, as you saw, my display on my Note 9 just went dim. This is actually mirroring what's there. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn the brightness back up on my phone through this app. As you can see, I'm controlling that there. And I'm going to go ahead and go home. So now... I'm mirroring my display to my Tab S6, which is cool. Very, very little latency, as you can see. Uh, but any app that you can use in landscape instead of portrait is great. So what I like to do is go to my YouTube. And you don't have to use your phone either. You can go here and go to, go to this tab, uh, folder here. So I'm going to go into YouTube here. Now... In this orientation here, I'm getting more display on my phone here. So what I like to do, I'm going to go into my library here. Uh, I'm just this for demonstration purposes so I don't get copyright. And I'm going to go ahead and play one of my, my videos here. And as you see, now as soon as I rotate this, I must have that locked. Now I'm getting the full display and what it does automatically, it will dull your screen over here. So that's not a distraction. And I can control volume. That's 30 seconds there. Let's right here. Get that same I can go here. full screen if I want. So it's giving me the full screen there. I can do everything I can do on my phone over there. I can change the video resolution here. And this is great. Like I said, when I'm out and I don't have Wi-Fi connection or whatever, it's great. And I, I think it's, it's a great feature that I really enjoy. So I'm going to have some more videos about uh, different things. As you can see, I can close it out. <laughs> I can go home here. Still got my little pop-up window here that I can move around. And I can do, but like I said, you want to use this to have take advantage, full advantage of it in apps that you can uh, turn into landscapes. So. All right, guys, just a short little video showing you one of my features that I like uh, between the two Samsung devices. Catch you guys in the next video. Will H, and I'm out.